Emergency medicine as an academic field and medical specialty hadn't yet gelled. That occurred really after the NCCU or in tandem with it. No one really paid a lot of attention to the brain issues. The development of a specialized neurological intensive care unit was really most important. The NCCU needed to be established because of the needs of several different departments at Johns Hopkins. And it required the cooperation between neurosurgery, neurology, anesthesia, critical care medicine, and eventually nursing. It's really important to understand that the neurocritically ill patient can be a very challenging patient to take care of. And so the nurses really depended on each other for support. And I do think that that was one of the things that really caused staff to be bound together by that shared experience. We've always been encouraged to ask questions and in observing the research process as administered by physicians, I think that there's a natural curiosity and inquiry that is fostered that has encouraged nurses to develop their own original questions. The graduates of our program, they have gone out to the world and they have made great things. We have fellows that have become leaders in many institutions. I think we're very proud of what we've done and all the training that we've undertaken.